everyone, we're at Embrace today. I was going to talk to Rebecca Whippy, who is the CEO, and also find out more about what Embrace do. So come along in. Embrace are a charity that was set up in 2014 to help disabled and special needs children and their families. Um, we help them access speech and language therapy, special school places, and we also have a children's centre where we offer them respite. Okay, brilliant. What, what made you start Embrace? Where did it all come from? My son, Harry, he's 13. He's got autism and dyslexia, ADHD and dyspraxia. Um, and he goes to a special school in Eastbourne and I've been really, really lucky for him to be placed there. Um, when I started working with um, local charities for disabled children, I realised that there was a real lack of legal advice for the families and as such, a lot of the children were ending up homeschooled, forced into homeschooling or out of school. Oh, right. um, and also there was a lack of lack of respite for social services, so none of these families were getting any support and the parents were having breakdowns, their mental health was affected. So I was surrounded by people that had a huge amount of problems and I was used to solving problems oh. as, because that's what I did as a legal representative. Okay. But the problem was I, there wasn't anywhere that I could train to do the area of law that I wanted to do because there's no money in it. Because, you know, nobody who's got a disabled child, they don't tend to have an awful lot of money because they can't work. Um, so what we launched was a cost-effective law service for those families. And also we do do pro bono work, which means we do sometimes work for free. We work in the tribunals. We work alongside the parents to get the best for the children and if we can't get it out of the local authority then we try and provide as much as we can ourselves. Okay, what kind of activities do you guys do here for children? Um, so the kids that come in during the week, a lot of them are homeschooled. Um, on Mondays um, we have literacy sessions with our English teacher Leanna, she's brilliant. Um, on Wednesdays we have messy play. It was very tidy today, <laughs> but it can get very messy. Okay. Um, and on Fridays we have um, pets as therapy coming with their therapy dogs sometimes. That's my personal favourite. <laughs> they're lovely, they're so gentle those dogs. Aww. And that's really popular. And we run sessions during the holidays for all the families, so all the kids can come, not just Aww. the one with special needs. Um, and on Tuesdays it's free of charge, so if you can't afford to go to those sessions, although they're very reasonably priced, then you can come in with your child on a Tuesday and we also have the law clinic then as well. Oh lovely, okay. Um, one more question then, Becca. Sure, I've totally forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> what would the money raised that we're going to do for uh, Magnificent Motors and the Carnival mean to embrace and the children here? Oh, it will mean it will mean a huge amount. There is there's no amount too small that can be raised for embrace. We're very grateful for everything, and it all goes back into improving the children's life chances and giving them a better quality of life. There are a lot of children in child poverty at the moment, and and parents that are really really stressed out. And if we can give them a little a little break, a little bit of support, you know, a little a little bit extra help to apply for disability living allowance or help to get their child into school, so there's one less thing they have to worry about. That's yeah. what the money will go on. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now that you've seen all the cool stuff that Embrace do, uh, here is where we come in. We are going to auction a car to raise money for Embrace. Uh, during the next few weeks, that car will be used for various events, including Magnificent Motors, uh, where we will take donations for children to decorate the car. And hopefully we'll end up with a nice, bright, colorful car, uh, which we will also be driving through Eastbourne Carnival prior to auctioning it off. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube videos or like our Facebook page to keep up to date. 
and just keep watching our page for more.